Hi guys, welcome to Tune Basics, the series that teaches you how to play the basics. Today, we'll be learning how to play the famous nursery rhyme, Frere Jaca on the tin whistle. Here is a penny whistle. This penny whistle is in the key of C. But don't worry if yours isn't in the key of C, because for this lesson, it is the finger holes that are important. When holding your penny whistle, remember that your left hand is positioned closest to your mouth and uses fingers 1, 2, and 3 to cover holes 1, 2, and 3. The right hand is positioned so that fingers 4, 5, and 6 can cover holes 4, 5, and 6. For these lessons, when you see a blue arrow pointing into the mouthpiece, this means blow gently enough to still produce notes. When you see a red arrow pointing into the mouthpiece, this means blow a bit harder to produce a higher note. So let's get straight into it. Here is what Frere Jaca looks like in the key of C. You'll notice that I've broken it up into four phrases. Here's what it sounds like. C, D, E, C, C, D, E, C, E, F, G, E, F, G, G, A, G, F, E, C, G, A, G, F, E, C, C, G, C, C, G, C. Let's take a closer look at phrase one. First, cover all six holes with fingers one to six and blow once. Then cover holes one to five with fingers one to five and blow once. Now cover holes one to four with fingers one to four and blow once. And finally, cover holes one to six with fingers one to six and blow once. Then repeat this phrase. And after some practice, you should end up with something that sounds like this. For the second phrase, you'll need to cover holes one, two, three, and four with fingers one, two, three, and four and blow once. Then cover holes one to three with fingers one, two, and three and blow once. Now cover holes one to two with fingers one to two and blow once. Then repeat this phrase once. And after some practice, you end up with something that sounds like this. For the third phrase, Cover holes 1 and 2 with fingers 1 and 2 and blow once. Then cover hole 1 with finger 1 and blow once. Cover holes 1 to 2 with fingers 1 to 2 and blow once. Cover holes 1 to 3 with fingers 1 to 3 and blow once. Cover holes 1 to 4 with fingers 1 to 4 and blow once. Cover holes 1 to 6 with fingers 1 to 6 and blow once. And then repeat this phrase once. And after some practice, you should be able to play it like this. For the last phrase, cover holes 1 to 6 with fingers 1 to 6 and blow once. Cover holes 1 to 2 and blow gently once. Cover holes 1 to 6 and blow once. Repeat this phrase once. After some practice, put all the phrases together and it will sound like this. And there you have it. So thank you for watching, and please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And also, please check out some of my other lessons. And until next time, stay tuned. See ya.